Dear Jackson, today is the day I become your wife. You are the answer to my prayers and everything I have ever dreamed of. The best decision I have ever made was saying yes to become your wife. It will be the biggest honor to introduce myself as that beginning today until forever. I will love you for as long as the Oklahoma sun sets. Love, your soon-to-be wife, Jenny. Dear Jenny, I love you and I am excited to marry you tonight. From the day we went on our first date, I knew that you were the one. When we finished our day together, I prayed that evening that you felt the same way I did. My heart was captured by your joyous spirit and sharp mind, and I asked God that evening that he would allow me to love you for the rest of my life. I say this often, but I truly am the most blessed man in this world. The Lord has blessed our love, and I look forward to being your husband, your best friend, your confidant, your defender for the rest of our lives. Today we will start our lives together. Love, Jax. <laughs> I would describe Jackson as an extremely kind and loyal person to all of his friends and family. Yeah, I just feel so blessed to be his best friend. Good, Never huh? cease to amaze. Love you. Best wishes, dear. Almighty God, in your goodness, you made man and woman. You made the covenant of marriage. Pour your blessings out upon this couple. The Lord God said, it is not good for the man to be alone. I will make him a suitable partner for him. This is why a man leaves his father and mother and clings to his wife, and the two of them become one body. Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly, as in all wisdom you teach and admonish one another, singing psalms, hymns, and spiritual songs with gratitude in your hearts to God. And whatever you do, in word or in deed, do everything in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through Him. I, Jackson, take you, Jenny, to be my wife. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you. I will love you. I will honor you. I will honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. Jenny, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Jackson, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. My friends, it is my great honor to introduce you, Mr. and Mrs. Jackson Stallings. A holy kiss and raucous Oklahoma applause. <laughs> I remember the first time Jenny came to our house. I guess you guys have been talking for about three or four months, and Jenny drove down from Pahuska. 
And the look on Jackson's face, I just remember. It was, she was the one, and she is the one. So, the best thing I've ever done in my life is marry my wife. And I, and I know the best thing Jackson's gonna do is marry Jenny. He's, you know, extremely passionate, uh, extremely dedicated guy, regardless of whether it's family, relationships, work, whatever it is. You know that Jackson's going to be 110%. Jackson's also quite decisive. Uh, he told me that he wanted to marry Jen after their first date together. And I just want you to know that I'm extremely proud of our friendship. And I'm proud that you guys are taking the next step in your lives together. I'm certain that you'll continue to push each other to be better than you were yesterday. And so when he told me about Jen, I just could see it in his eyes and his smile um, that it was a real deal. And I could only think about how lucky Jenny was going to be. Um, and then I met Jenny. And at this very moment, I figured out I was actually all wrong. Jackson was the lucky one. <laughs> she was this beautiful, smart, driven person that Jackson had met. Um, and I couldn't, I mean, it's, it's beautiful to see you guys together. From being two small town kids, graduating Ivy League schools, now attending law school together, no one can deny the drive and ambition each of you have independently, which is so admirable. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. My favorite book, movie, by Jim Harrison is Legends of the Fall. It's about three brothers and their life experiences. At one point, the narrator says regarding the youngest sibling, there was nothing these brothers would not do for him. They watched over him like a treasure and Jenny as just our treasure. Jenny does absolutely anything she sets her mind to, and we all admire her for that. I remember when she started talking about this new boy, Jackson. I knew he was different from anyone else because she lit up when speaking about him. Her eyes were bright, her smile was wide, and it still is today. She gets so excited, even last night. she was with all of her friends and the bridesmaids, but she was just so excited to see him today. I wish you all unending an happiness and that comfy, cozy love that lasts a lifetime. Cheers.
the Lord God bless you. May his face shine upon you. May his angels guard your home and your children. And may he bring you at last to the fulfillment of all love, which is heaven. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit.